He had bundles of memories that he often shared with me on a lighter note. Inigo, have some medicine. When asked upon, he remained very silent for a while. Then he told me what happened in the year 1537, when the first companions came to Rome. They had no home to call as their own. After some time, lo and behold, a friend of Ignatius offered him an abandoned haunted house. He took lines with him to see it. It was very dark. Hesitantly, Linus and Ignatius walked into the house. Oh, Ignatius. Let me tell you frankly, from childhood onwards, I am afraid of darkness. Do you want me to go first? Okay. Better after you, I feel. Okay. Let's go. Maybe I'll be dinner for someone today. Carpet work. Come this way, Linus. Don't be scared, Linus. If you see anything, remain calm. Well then. This room will be our dining hall. Okay. Father Ignatius, I can't see you. Where are you? Father Ignatius, where are you? Thank you. 
Linus? Linus? Oh, really scares me, father. We better find another. Linus, don't worry. We'll make it holy soon. Come. Don't look back. Always have your eyes in front. <laughs> On the following day, they worked all day to make it clean. But much to be done. Meanwhile, Ignatius left no stone unturned to find a benefactor. Ignatius was a very persuasive person. He could convince everyone almost anyone he found a benefactor Linus, come here so we got the benefactors thank god for the initiatives yes you need not worry. So the engineers will be repairing the whole house. Once the house was ready, he remained there forever. His pilgrimage stopped forever. Dear Cardinal, thanks for your valuable contributions. We, the Jesuits, will ever be grateful for your generosity. He dedicated his time to writing constitutions, documents on the religious life, and his affectionate letters to his companions were spread throughout the world. 
He was almost busy every day, every hour. Are they dishes? Are they dishes? Our engineer has given the plan of the church space. This will be the sanctuary and this will be the entrance. How shall we name it? Jesu. Wow. Jesu. What better name can we find? We got the funds for the building of Roman College and Martha House. Linus, all we do is for the greater glory of God. Isn't it beautiful, my friends? The Society of Jesus had such humble beginnings and Ignatius of Loyola built the Society of Jesus brick by brick. <laughs> Pablo. <laughs> now it is our bounded duty to continue the legacy. After this magnificent, beautiful, faithful soul. <laughs>